What's up, everybody? It's your boy, Big Dre, and happy Sunday. Sundays are for church, and that's where I'm headed right now. I can't wait to get there, and uh, so that's what we're doing today. All right, so Abundant Life, here I come. So the challenge is, are you willing to go all the way? So in order for this to translate, now we have a better understanding of that walk that Abraham took. This wasn't the easy walk. Your journey is not going to be an easy journey. So when you commit, as the last man says, yes. to increasing your faith, <clears throat> right? When you see what Abraham did in the lesson, it tells us at the end, commit to increasing your faith in God and obedience to him. So as I learned of what it took for Abraham to get here. What am I willing to do to get what I need? And God is now, he's saying, okay, because when I look at challenging your faith, I'm, still, I'm talking to God like, okay, well, what I need to do, right? So now once something is presented to me, I know how to handle it and think about what he said and what was said because in that moment it was bigger than Abraham he had to prove something yes. and because of him proving his obedience we said he became the father of faith but then he is the father because that lineage had to go on yes. so that plan was bigger than that moment yes, you thinking you just going to end it right here and that's, it's about right now it ain't about right now yes. you got to be able to or see it yes, sir. because your obedience can change the course Ooh. of a generation. Yes, sir. Amen. We believe God for the more. God's going to do more. Eyes haven't seen, ears haven't heard, even haven't entered into the hearts of men what God has prepared for his people. And we just believe God this morning that God's getting ready to do something in the midst of us. Amen. How many know God is yet a healer? Hallelujah. God is yet a way maker. Come on, somebody. God still delivers. He still opens up doors. He still makes ways. Amen. He still does what only God can do. Amen. He's an incredible God. An incredible God deserves an incredible praise. Is that all right? Amen. An incredible God deserves an incredible praise. And we're thankful today for our here being an amen. I'm just going to do something real different today. Amen. Thank God for Brother Dre. Brother Dre, he's not just an organ player. He's not just a keyboard player. But my Brother Dre can sing a little bit too. Amen. He can sing a little bit too. Amen. So I'm going to ask uh, Brother Dre. Amen. Y'all get him a mic. He's going to lead us in a couple congregational songs here. Amen. I think he can do it. Anybody believe he can do it? Come on. You think, do you believe you can do it? Hey, come on, clap your hands for this guy and get out of here. Oh uh -huh. 
shifting us beyond this. Somebody needs a breakthrough. Somebody needs a way to be born. And I beg you just to worship him in this moment. In this time. In this space. Come on. Open up your mouths. Make the atmosphere rich with your worship. Foxes have holes, birds have nests, but the Son of Man have no other way to say, Lay your head on us today, Jesus. Somebody, I know who to I'm on. I'm on Jesus. Hallelujah. I'm a good team. Church was off the chain today. Oh my God. Church was off the chain. Got my spiritual lift for the week and uh, on my way to pick Michelle up and we're headed to Sam's Club. Got some Christmas shopping to do. 